Hello everyone, this is Austin Learning with Animals. Repeat the animal word that I'm saying. Alligator. Did you know that an alligator has big, strong jaws? Butterfly. Butterfly's wings go flap, flap. Budgerigar. Budgerigars are pet that's live in a cage. Okay, so now, um, this is so fantastic. We're going to hear from a young adult and her success. Bear. Bears are brown. There are many different types of bears all over the world. Bison. Hi, bear with me. Sorry about that. Bisons are very furry cows. Beaver. Okay. Beaver's home is called a lodge. Uh, my name is Alexis Pratt. I'm 21 years old. And I'm Have you talked to your parents about your learning disability? Buffalo. Yes, I have talked to my mom about my learning disability. Buffaloes live in Africa. I was in middle school and then I would receive something called an IEP that gave me accommodations. This helped me with my schoolwork and successfully graduate. Bees love to sting you. Bees. Bull. A bull is a male cow. Thank you so much. Bull. Alexa Pratt, that was fantastic, and we so appreciate her being able to share that piece of her journey with us today. Black Panther. Black so Panthers are very scary cats. Born owl. Barn owls come from uh, South America. And within the community. Um, it also provides legal protection against discrimination. And that's the ADA or the American Bat. Bats are nocturnal. Of expectations people may have for your ability. And it also ensures that you get what you need to be. Bluebird. At your job. Bluebirds are very pretty. Bunny. A bunny is a baby rabbit. <coughs> Beetle. Beetles don't make any sound. Caterpillar. He has lots of legs, don't you? Cat. Cats sometimes live in cities. Cat. Catfish. Catfish live in the ocean. Catfish. Cow. I love having cow milk for breakfast. And it's interesting because she, she actually, one of our conferences said, you know, you, no one here plans on going to college with their kids. Parent chicken. Parent that I am. <laughs> Chickens live in a chicken coop. Okay, all right, that's, that's your choice. Chicken. Chick. Chicks are born in an egg. Um, Chick. Asking for your accommodations, then going into college because they don't really care who's paying the bills at your college. They are only going to talk to the students. So it's a great school, it's a great place to practice. Asking for camel. To be successful. Camels, you. People used to use camel to ride on for deserts. Employment is important. Um, disclosure about having a disability, again, it is a personal choice. However, you can keep in mind that in order to be eligible for housing assistance, you must 
Cheetah. Cheetahs are very fast. Cheetah. Chipmunk. Alvin, Simon, and Theodore are in the movie Alvin and the Chipmunks. Chipmunk. Dog. Dogs are humans, women's, and man's best friend. Dinosaur. Dinosaurs are extinct. Dinosaur. Dolphin. Dolphins live in the ocean. Dolphin. Donkey. Donkeys are very helpful around the farm. Donkey. Duck. Ducks live on the pond. Duck. Deer. Deers have pretty antlers. Their antlers are their horns. Eagle. Eagles soar high up on the sky. Eagle. Eel. An electric eel has very big powers. Electric eel. Elephant. The elephant is the largest living land animal. Now, I believe we're going to have questions in just a few minutes, but we do have a poll. Frog. Frogs sleep in the sun all day. Fish. Fish live in the water. Gazelle. Gazelles are called antelopes. Goat. Goats live in mountains and farms. They are awesome rock hopping jumpers. And goats even climb trees, Mama. It looks like we're probably finished. Goose. Geese swim like ducks. Goose. So you will see this is Dawn again. Gorilla. If you have Gorillas know, are very strong apes. Put in the chat box what you Gorilla. Feel, uh, resources or supports you feel would be helpful to you to turn that no into a yes. Giraffe. That's quite a neck. And then Don't Lauren, you? that was wonderful. Thank you so much. I love your stories. I think that they really help to bring um, reality to some of the situations and we can relate to them. Horses rides so are if you fun. Have a question for Laura, you can go ahead and put it in the chat box. Um, or you, if you don't want to put it in the pet chat box, you can raise your hand and we will um, Hippo. Will, the hippo uh, is the I'm, third yeah. largest living land mammal. So I see that hippo. there is a question. Let's see. Um, from Hans, is it best to wait Hamster. until start asking questions? Hamsters live in a cage. My concern is that making a point of bringing it up before our second grader is ready could make him feel self-conscious or different in a negative way. Hog. Does not a hog is a male pig. Hog. I can be us as parents and guardians. Um, 
Hyena. Hyenas are very funny mammals. Hyena. Iguana. Iguana is a reptile. Iguana. Jaguar. Jaguars are spotted cats. Jaguar. Kangaroo. Kangaroos have big, and powerful I feet. Have to put a label on it. Kangaroo. I think, um, just if you see them struggling, just really starting that conversation with, you know, um, lion. Not everyone is the same. The lion some is are, the king of the you know, jungle. Excel in math and some excel lion. In language arts and and maybe for you, math ladybug. Is a difficult, ladybugs are Johnny, spotted insects. This is some help ladybug. So that you can do better in math. Lovebird. Um, so lovebirds and, and are in lovebirds. Know their children. Um, I think this really love is bird. meant to start the conversation for you as a parent as well. So that lamb. You, know, you see the A lamb is a baby of, sheep. We're um, talking to lamb because it, they, it goes all the way into adulthood. Um, Lizard. Okay, so let's see. Lizards uh, we have a question love here to swim. From someone that says, "What do you suggest?" Lizard the professor publicly asks the students to raise their hand if they want to go to the test. Macaw for distraction. Free Macaws testing. mimic Even your big fat speech. Oh, I have a lot that I think. No, <laughs> I think that um, monkey. Um, you're absolutely right. They submitted monkey the swing from tree um, to tree. Would, um, monkey. Um, with um, the students of talking to their professor and saying, you know, that um, the reason why mouse privately is because I mice I eat cheese to every single person that I meet. Mouse. I appreciate it. Um, it didn't ask me to raise my hand, but I did go when I needed to leave the room. Mammoth. Um, I think this is a great opportunity to. Mammoths are large extinct animals. Mammoth. Um, and if they don't feel comfortable, I would suggest being able to practice with that conversation and how to start that conversation um, with the college professor. I, agree. Mule. I think that, um, you know, mules look just like donkeys. That afterwards, Mule. you go to the professor and have a conversation. I, you know, I'm not comfortable saying this out loud in front of the whole class, but I did, you know, speak to them privately about it so they understand Mole. it. And again, this is their Moles live underground in a hole. Um, I did want to say, because Felicia saying she was hoping for more information for young children, like early elementary. Otter. Felicia, I would recommend Otters roll website. over in the river. Yeah, we did a webinar in February called uh, Supported Decision Making and Alter Alternatives to Owl. Now, Owls um, are nocturnal not birds. in that area because the child Owl. is young. But if you listen through that PowerPoint, there is a section where Ostrich. we talk about different things you Ostriches can do are fast on, birds. starting as early as kindergarten Ostrich. to help build the child's um, self-advocacy skills and teach oh, them to... Um, oh, copies come from Africa and, and South so, America. Um, if you check that out, oh, um, copy. you can download that PowerPoint as well, and there are great suggestions in that PowerPoint. Uh, my son just started college. I have suggested he get help from tutoring center. He has not gone yet. Any suggestions? So, um, suggest. I would ask him how he thinks college is going. How does he feel? Does he feel comfortable? How is he doing today? Um, let him. If, uh, let him. Pronghorn. Uh, Pronghorns are excellent with jumpers. Pronghorn. Penguin. Um, Penguins come from so Antarctica. I think it's asking him doing a temperature test. How do you feel? Um, how do you think it's going? 
Pigs love the mud. Pig. Piglet. A piglet is a baby pig. Pig. Piglet. Yeah, I agree, um, Laura, because puppy. this is something that, you know, our children a without puppy disabilities is a baby you know, dog. Um, struggle with. I mean, I have puppy. a son in college right now, and it's really hard for me to tell him what to do because I'm so used to doing that. Panther. He has to figure it out on Panthers his own. live so, in a yeah, cave. Said, um, you know, you, Black. What, you know, if you're Panther. Struggling, what do you think you should do? Panther. Um, what, Tutoring is, is a great option. Um, so, yeah, starting that conversation whether your child has a disability or not. Um, and Felicia, you'll see there that we put in the link to that webinar that um, I mentioned Proud earlier, Oryx. So go ahead and the Proud Oryx that. lives in the Proud Place, Africa. Um, any other questions? So, proud uh, Greg has a question. Um, the little Porcupine. Adam, the Porcupines are spotted. Touching. This Spiked. Is a great presentation, by the way. Um, Porcupine. And it's good for us to be hands off. Is there a way to get more insight Pony. from the students? Ponies are small horses. The situation that our kids can see. Pony. Getting info from their peers might make great impact upon other students. I couldn't agree with you more. Um, we Panda bear. Talked, um, Panda bears come from um, China. Laura, myself, and Panda. Others. In, in collaborating to put this together, Pigeon. we did not originally start out Pigeons with Pigeons look like dogs. And we felt that it would be very Pigeon. impactful to include it, and I'm glad that it was. Um, there are many ways Peacock. for... Um, he's beautiful when he spreads its tail. To find. I mean, we all need support, right? I mean, you know, we as parents need support, so they need support as well. So there's youth partnerships that they can look for um, where they can meet up with um, their peers. So, um, I don't know, Laura, what do you think on that? Polar bear. Polar bears are chili bears. Polar bear. And I know this is really hard to um, Are scary. Rabbit. Rabbits are excellent <laughs> hoppers. Rabbit. Raccoon. Raccoons. That's have a mask. That's quite a mask, isn't um, it? Also, Greg, I'm not sure Raccoon. what state you're in. If you are in New Jersey, we are having um, Rooster. a transition conference. In Roosters are boy chickens. And Roosters. Parents, but within that conference, there will be an opportunity for you to sign your student who is of transition age up, and they will spend a day with other young um, youth and talk about self-advocacy and um, Robin. Um, Robin make a beautiful sound. Process. So I Robin. your email. I will send you that flyer so that maybe if you like, you can sign your uh, young person up for that. Seal. Um, and Melissa, Seals or Melissa live asked, in the water. Can they get Seal. more that will not be going on to college? Salamander. Salamanders. That's so, quite a newt, yeah, doesn't I'm it? Salamander. Kind of speak from New Jersey. That would Skunk. So, Skunks are very cool stinky. Right Skunk. Squirrel. Squirrels eat acorns. Squirrel, snail, this snail's name is Gary, snail, sea lion, sea lions can be found in reefs,
Sea turtle. Sea turtles live in the reef. Sea turtle. Sheep. Sheep like to get haircuts. When sheep get haircuts, it's called sheep sharing. Right, Mama? Snake. Snakes have no legs. Snake. Tiger. Tigers have stripes. Tiger. Turtle. Turtles move really slow on land. Turtle. Trumpeter swan. The trumpeter swan lives in the reef. Trumpeter swan. Turkey. Turkeys come from Thanksgiving. Turkey. Wildebeest. When wildebeest run in a herd, it's called a stampede. Wildebeest. Walrus. Walruses can be found in beaches. Walrus. Whale. Whales have the loudest call in the water. Whale. Wolf. Wolves are very scary dogs. Wolf. And last one. Zebra. Zebra stripes are so cool. Zebra. Thank you for watching me learning about the animals. Which animal was your favorite in that video? Subscribe to the channel now.